I'm going to gamble too. And here's my wage. You gotta be shitting me. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's React. I'm Kenny and this is Montana. And today we're going to be reacting to Season 1, Episode 23 of Attack on Titan, Smile, Assault on Stohas, Part 1. We have reached the final three episodes of Season 1. It's been a long journey, but how are you feeling going into this episode? I feel like I don't know everything. Yes. <laughs> That's true. In season one, we don't know everything. Basically, so much has happened well, and so much mission. is yet to be revealed. And it seems like things are really bad. And I don't really know what direction things can go. And I don't understand how they knew about the female Titan enough to set up a trap, but not enough to tell people. I just, it's a whole, it's a we whole gotta, conundrum. We gotta just see what's um, happening. But let's just go ahead and yeah. dive in. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below if you've enjoyed this series and are excited for episode 24 coming this Thursday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We are switching to two episodes a week now. It'll be on Sundays and Thursdays at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so be on the lookout for that moving forward. Also, check out the Patreon linked in the description below if you want to go ahead and see episodes 23, 24, and 25 now. All right, are we excited for episode 23 of Attack on Titan? Oh yeah, I can't wait. All right, let's get it. Let's go. Underheads, this video was brought to you by the incredible members of the Let's React Patreon. If you want access to a ton of exclusive perks, check out the link in the description below. Have a good day, Twinkle Toes. I am so excited for her to watch this episode. Oh my god. Here we go. Let's go, Daddy! I expect the best from my daughter. Move! Who told you it was time to rest? Is that Sasha's backstory? Uh, that was not. Okay. He said Annie. Oh, about Annie, Annie. Fuck, yeah. that's who I meant. Ignore that. <laughs> Hold on. You mean you haven't heard? The Titan Kid and those big shot handlers of his have been summoned to the capital. Well, then maybe this time they'll just dissect him and get it over with. I just hope There's still so many people against trouble. Aaron. Mm -hmm. I say let him pass through and seal the gate shut behind him. Infidel. To even suggest sealing the gate. Huh? The hands of heretics must never take the sanctity of our walls! The wall cultist. <sighs> Maria, Rose, Cena! To even think of defiling the three goddesses, we tempt the specter of them. These lunatics all worship the walls as if they're some kind of gods. Yikes. Oh. me out. Damn cult. Can't believe they're still around. Let's that is culty. Look who's finally awake. So she was, she's in you the so military place. When you're asleep, mm -hmm. I didn't dare disturb you. Probably should have. Sorry. You've been pretty lax in your duties recently. Look, Marlo, you've upset her. She's antisocial, not upset. Knock it off. What's you going guys. on? She fought in the Battle of Trost before coming here, which makes her the only one of us who's ever seen any. Yeah, but she's action. having dad nightmares, so yeah. I feel like that's maybe. Well, it takes time to readjust. Rough upbringing. Ah. Great. Thanks, guys. I called you all here because I've got actual work for you today, not just the same old crap. It's got something to do with the scouts being summoned to the capital. Sometime today, they'll be passing through town along the main street. HQ has already provided a security detail, so we're only being asked to assist until the convoy's clear. ODM use in city limits has been authorized. You'll follow beside the convoy as additional Wonder security. Wonder where they have to authorize use of ODM gear. Waiting. While Cena, the people inside of it, I feel like are very sheltered. Mm -hmm. So like ODM gear is kind of seen as like the scouts, the fighting titans. Oh, that titans. would be too like, scary. It's too allow you know what I mean? for them. Gotcha. Like, it disrupts the vision mm -hmm. of peace. Sir, a nice, I was going to say nice cut. <laughs> Go ahead. What exactly are we supposed to be protecting this convoy from, sir? It's just that I've never so heard scouts of are coming through in a convoy. Mm -hmm. They're just glad to be safe. There are petty criminals, sure. But I find it hard to imagine any actual organization existing within the wall that would attempt to strike. I mean, what possible motive would they have? Man, aren't you serious? You can be in charge uh, of this. Everything you need to know is right in here. Uh, huh? We officers are busy enough as it is. Prove that you can handle this one yourselves. You better not screw it up, got it? Hey, sorry about that. Back to business. Who's turn was uh, Yikes. Yeah. So what do you make of uh, the MP? Damn. 
I mean, they very clearly never had to face any of the actual issues facing the entirety of the wall community. Yeah. It's just like a completely separate world inside the innermost wall. Does it remind you a little bit of how the guards on Wall Mario were at the beginning of the show where they were yes. just... 100%. It's just a lack of awareness. A lack of terror. A lack of seeing yeah. them. Something really bad is going to need to happen inside the innermost wall in order for the military police to do literally anything about yeah. it. This stinks. Got that right. The amount of slacking that goes on in this outfit is even more than I imagined. I mean, that is why I chose to join, but still. <laughs> I might have thought twice if I'd known that meant the rookies got stuck doing all the work all the time. Seriously. I wish You're someone uh, would have warned Bastards. Me. They're all irresponsible, self-absorbed imbeciles. All of them. Nice cut. I just... So what's that make you, <laughs> so Marlo? Bad. You chose to join the military police. You're a slacker just like the rest of us. It's funny that it goes from You're top of your class to slacker like when you get there. You, you know what I mean? Well, the thing that's really interesting is the people that they have protecting, like, the innermost wall, like, theoretically the last resort, are the laziest, most terrified. I joined up because the military police is in dire need of repair. That was great, Marlo. I never begged you for the crusader type. So his name's I'm Marlo. I'm my way mm -hmm. to the top, of course. And then once I'm in charge, I can install a new system to make sure all those who are dishonest pay for their transgressions. It's as simple as that. The MPs just need a little discipline and nothing more. I'll shape them back. I'm sorry, I can't take people seriously. <laughs> Look at their face. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I like her hair a lot. <laughs> Does have some nice hair. Very fluffy. Oh, that's a rather lofty idea. What's the point? Huh? I think if a do-gooder like you was actually put in charge of this regiment, you'd quickly find yourself working alone. Really? Somebody thought that's you could do an Annie cosplay. You your mouth to say? <laughs> yeah. You don't know what? I see it. I don't doubt your sincerity. I know conviction when I see it. You're not the first person I've met who thought they could take over the world and change things I just things need a claw clip. <laughs> it takes a lot of courage to go Same against fist. the flow. I respect that. Of course, it could be that you're all just a bunch of fools. They might be, but don't go lumping me in with them. Is that understood? <sighs> Enough chit chat. Let's go! So, the scouts are gonna come through at some point. <sighs> hey, watch it, bud! What's going on? That's our gear! Shipping it to the interior? Isn't it a bit strange having the Merchants Guild conduct the transport? What are they Why do they to? need to move that gear? Hmm. All right. I feel like whatever this is fits into the category of like government not. Did you hear that? Interesting. Okay. Hey, this That's isn't not where I was going at all. Illegally selling it. Yeah. All right. Well, I suppose we have. I was wrong about that one. I bet this will be entertaining. I'd say we've earned ourselves a drink. Hmm? What do you think you're looking at, huh, rookie? You... you can't sell government equipment. It's against the law. Like they're gonna listen. So? Well, who are they the selling government the equipment to? Because the only people who taxes. need it are other government workers. <laughs> Theoretically. I think they sold it to Merchants Guild. Right, but who needs it? I'm thinking you've got a bright future. You can't answer me. They're trying to bribe him. Yikes. Wait! Hey! What you did was against the law! Okay. Oh my god. Not good. Well. Ah. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you okay? I don't... They really like themselves a good kicking. They here. really do. Hey, wait. Annie, what are we doing? <laughs> You're under arrest for a treasonable offense against an officer. Blatant disregard for the rule of law is standard procedure. So is this. He's had enough, don't you think, sir? <laughs> so sorry about that, fellas. I hope our idiot hasn't caused you too much trouble. We'll be sure to try to let him know. so badass. Home, what do you yeah. think? She's incredible. A 
Unless, of course, you'd rather have a much bigger problem on your hands. Hmm. <clears throat> just this once. So they just completely get away with it? Yep. Hmm. Frustrating. Go ahead. Aren't you going to make the dishonest pay for their transgressions? I'm not entirely opposed to helping you out with that. <laughs> So he's thinking about shooting them. Yeah. Just like he said. Nah. Damn it! The thing about ideals. Hey, those people you know. The other fools you mentioned. Would they have done it? They might have. <laughs> I wanted to be brave. To go against the flow. But when it comes down to it, I've just a piece literally of just being swept hard. away by the That's current. a thing. Yeah. Not sure what to say about that. Humans aren't meant to do that. Maybe. That's just a part of what it means to be ordinary. <laughs> Simply going with the flow. Is that so bad? To some people it makes you weak. But an ordinary person is all I want to be. Here come here comes the convoy. All right. So very uniform horses. <laughs> I love how we need the horse commentary anytime the horses come. Well, no, I'm just saying none of them have any facial markings whatsoever. <laughs> Do you hear that? Yeah, someone called her down the alleyway. Hello. So, you're a full-fledged MP now. So Armin has found Annie and is giving her right. a little chat. What mm -hmm. do we think? I think Armin's going to tell her about Aaron and like the intricacies of what's going on there. Mm. She could potentially start something within the military police mm. because she, from what I can tell, is the only one within the military police with like a strong sense of self. and. Yeah. Anyone were going to start an uprising, make things different within the MP, I do think it would be Annie. Her whole thing was just like, I just want to be normal. I just want to mm -hmm. be like, I want to just do what everyone else does. I wish I could. So, toss up. What's with the outfit? Why I'm in the rain gear, you mean? It's a makeshift disguise. <laughs> Needed to conceal It's raining. <laughs> See? Oh, shit. Okay. What's this about? Annie. We have a plan for Aaron to escape, and we're hoping that you'll help us. Wait. Oh. Escape to where? Okay. Stuck behind these walls. Where can you possibly hide that they won't find you? We'll only need to hide him for a short while. This isn't a mutiny. We have every intention of returning. View this as a few loyal scouts staging a small act of protest. It's a stall tactic. We need time to gather enough evidence to overrun the Council's ruling about Aaron. That's it's a logical plan. Need. You're serious about this? Yeah, but him running away is How not going to look sure good. Evidence exists? That's true. And what is it? I can't say. Yeah, all great I'm points. Sorry. Um. <sighs> sorry, Armin. I'm going to have to decline. My lips are sealed, though. Best of luck. Hold on. Annie, please. They're going to kill Aaron. They'll kill him for no better reason than that they fear what they don't understand. That's they don't true. See that they're they're just pushing humanity to the brink of extinction. Maybe it's too late to change their minds. But what if we can? We have no choice but to bet everything on that chance. Right? Yeah. I'm sorry. The last thing we want is to cause you grief. But well, the only way to sneak him through the wall scene at checkpoints is with the help of someone in the military police. It's only hope but why me do I really look like that good of a person to you a good person I don't know you don't have to be a good Actually, person for I've this never placed much value in those sorts of labels the way I see it good is merely a word applied to people who are convenient to our needs in some way it's purely subjective 
anyone. He's so smart. Yeah. Labeling people to humanizes them. Regardless, if you still choose to say no to this request, then at least in my eyes, that makes you a bad person. Interesting. Interesting to pull the... I don't think there's a such thing as a good person or a bad person. But I know. But if I did, it, this would make bad you person. a bad person. <laughs> I'm not trying to be like a dick or anything, but like, why did the gun That's have to like come off and be loaded for that? True. Like that just looked like she was gonna shoot him. Yeah, right? that was like, like a little bit dramatic. Right, and f for what? Literally, <laughs> for literally no reason. Mm -hmm. I get it though. We made it. <laughs> Can't believe it was so easy. Wow. The military police are at His work. eyes are just so, so beautiful. Let's just keep moving. Hopefully, they haven't noticed my stand-in yet either. It's not gonna hold up in a close screw. I'm sorry. <laughs> For Sean, real? Yeah. Nothing like. It's close. It's I. It's John with the wig. Scowl and the same boulder sized chip on your shoulder. All right. Yeah, I, I didn't anticipate that I don't happening. Have this horse face, he said. Then what was your plan B for getting over the wall? We would have used our ODM gear to parch right through the checkpoint. That's stupid. Why didn't you just avoid all this trouble in the first place? You could have escaped before reaching Stohas, right? I mean, why wait till now? I felt that this town's complex layout would allow us to squeeze a bit more time out of our body double ploy. No one's of in course, the streets right the head now. On assault yeah. is ill advised. So as long as the convoy acts like it's following orders, then everyone keeps their defenses down. It's a very good plan. <sighs> there it is. Here. Yeah, it's what remains of an underground city they were planning to build way back when. Interesting, and right? right? An underground city. The vicinity of the outer gate. Any so relation to the basement? <laughs> ah. Any. What's the matter? You're not afraid of dark, cramped spaces or anything, are you? So what? So what if I am? Hmm. I wouldn't expect a suicidal maniac Getting a like childhood you trauma vibes. You yeah. don't Dark. know what it is to be an ordinary girl, crippled with fear. A girl who can flip a full-grown man upside down. That's and true. To fear yeah. The dark. Cut the I feel crap. like she can't Let's call move. herself ordinary. She might want no, to be, but she isn't. I refuse. I'm too afraid. Above ground, I'll help. Otherwise, the deal's off. She just won't go. What happened to her underground? Quit being stubborn, damn it! Just get the hell down here! Move! We're running oh, out of time, all right? Shouting. Someone will hear you. I'm sure it's fine, Mikasa. It seems that for whatever reason, this place has been completely deserted. Wait. Does she know? The way you're looking at me now. If I had no better, I'd say you didn't trust me. Hey, Armin. Annie, tell me, what were you doing with Marco's ODM gear? When they checked. What are the gear? all the people going? All that the people are on the roof. The yeah. and scrapes. It was Marco's See, gear. I mm -hmm. helped him with maintenance, so I know you used it. Yes. I found it. Found it and took it. The two titans we had in custody. It was you that killed them. No one knows. What? But if you suspected all of this a month ago, why did you wait this long to say anything? Because even now it's difficult. I wait, I don't... Want, I didn't want to believe that I was right. So I stayed quiet. But then... But I'm just monumentally confused right now. <laughs>
Are you just monumentally yes, confused? Is she you. bad? <laughs> of course. I never dreamed you'd end up cornering me like this. She's cornered? Who's cornered her? The, the roof people? I thought they were on her side. Annie, please! Well, maybe they're after Aaron or something. Don't fall. I'm gonna say something. I'm gonna say something. It's no, Annie of the female no, I Titan. Like I told you, I don't have the That's an interesting idea. Annie, stop! I don't know, but let's like just. Yeah, you it. can't say anything, but I, I'm like really not face. understanding what's Enough. going on here. I'm not listening to another word of this. No point. She's so badass. Very cool. Creepy. What? <laughs> you know, Armin, it's nice that I could be a good person for you. For now, at least, it looks like you won your bet. But I'm going to gamble too, and here's my weight. You gotta be shitting me. Are you? Fucking kidding me? Are you? F I mean, just for real? Well, wait. Well, no, she. Well, they got. Well, wait. They're suspecting. I mean, she's acting suspicious. Isn't Why is she trying? Oh God, not the. What are you? It's too late. Those are very similar eyes. Oh no. Oh my God. So it was her. It was her? Fuck. And that is where we are left this episode with the reveal. Annie is the female Titan. You had. You've got to be sh shitting. No me. idea. You've got to be sh And this is where they leave us. Is it? it every time. I can't do this. Every okay. single. So we have to okay. watch the next one like right like, now. Like literally right, right now. Like, literally. Okay. Um, let's do questions, I guess. Um, so um, yeah, but uh <laughs> but every Annie moment up until that point had like massive giant hints and I just completely um, missed it. You yeah. you must have been Can I, just rolling. Okay. So, yeah. Thank you for watching that episode. Uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below if you're excited for our next episode coming this Thursday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It is already posted to the Patreon, so if you cannot wait and want to see that epic transformation, check out the Patreon linked in the description below. We have a lot to discuss, but before we do that, where are we headed? The episode verdict. The mm -hmm. question I haven't been asking you is, who do you think the female Titan is? Because they made it clear right. it was somebody, it was one of them. Yeah. But you never guessed at it. Not no. once. No. Why did you never guess? Like, literally. I thought it was someone we didn't know. They said thought... the person had to be there that day. Right. No, no, no. I meant. And I, Armin said it's when one of us. We. We. Gotcha. As in us. There are lots of scouts whose names we don't know. They're just one of the scouts. You just thought it was a random scout? I thought we deliberately hadn't been introduced to them yet. <laughs> I thought it was. <laughs> nope. Thank you for watching that episode. We're going to answer questions from our Patreon members, but before we do, I'm going to give myself a pat on the back because Montana had no idea. Didn't spoil once. That no was impressive. Idea. That was impressive. And here's the thing. I wanted to ask you after every episode, I was like, who any guesses who the female who Titan is? is? And the very notion of that, I thought Montana would be smart enough to be like, okay, by asking that, it's somebody it we know. It has to be someone it's I know the name of. It's a guessable name. Yeah. Which is like... That's I, what I, I thought it deliberately wasn't a guessable name for that reason. Which is why I didn't ask. If very I had smart. asked, do you think you would have put them together? I mean, you asked if I had any ideas about who the female Titan might be, but I still thought it was one of the scouts we hadn't met yet. Yeah, but uh, also uh, another... Annie, so uh, for real, I liked her. Yeah, and that's Am I thing. not allowed to like her anymore? Oh, they, it, I probably not. She killed like a lot of people. I mean, did people. you see what the female Titan was doing? Yeah. Also, the female Titan's hair is the same as Annie's. Yeah. I hope you know. And yeah. the eyes. You're right. The eyes are the same. People, we're going to get to Why? question one. Um, Easy Spice 99 asks, Annie has, up till now, presented as stoic, no-nonsense character, 
making the only difference between her and, say, Toph, the absence of humor and casual interpersonal interactions with other characters, save for the corpses she apologized to in Trost. What is your opinion of Annie after the implication of her killing Marco and her ruthlessness towards the Survey Corps, sparing Armin's life in her first appearance as a Titan and later making the fatal mistake to let her guard down and trusting Armin in the next episode? Basically, like, what do you think of her decisions up till now? So I don't quite understand what she stands to gain from killing people as the female Titan, but but now knowing that she is the female Titan, the fact that she was like so not interested in like making friends with her comrades and fellow scouts mm -hmm. and, you know, not really like making connections like that makes a ton of sense now. Yeah. So it's it wasn't really like a stoicism as much as just like a deliberate not involvement. Mm -hmm. I mean, she's obviously brilliant. I again, I feel like I don't know enough about what the female Titans, what's driving her. Two times she trusted Armin. I I think she knows Armin is smart, and I feel like that would maybe not work to her advantage, yeah. but maybe she needs him to be with Aaron. Like, that would be my guess. But isn't it kind of a weird but little, that like, it goes against everything else? she was willing to, because I would say, like, oh, she just has a soft spot for Armin, but that doesn't make any fucking sense, because she was just as close with Armin as she was with all of her other, like, scout friends who she just destroyed. There are a couple different dynamics that I'm struggling to put together right now, because Armin didn't know that she was a female titan when he asked for her help. You can't answer that. We already King kind of Annie, asked Annie, are you shitting me? You still me? can't get it. No. But are you excited to go to the next episode? Like, like yes. But, uh, Annie? Um, <laughs> what? Okay. Um. How did Armin know? I can't, I can't, you can't ask There's these so questions because okay, I want to answer. Okay, fine, I'll stop, I'll stop. Um, Emily McDonald, knowing now that Annie is the female Titan, what do you think for saying an ordinary person is all I want to be? There's an aspect of resenting her powers, which is interesting because I feel like if you fully resented your powers, you would just not use them, right? Like that's not a crazy leap to make, yeah. but she does and kills a lot of people who she, it's not like she's killing her friends. Like she made it very clear that like they're not not friends, but she didn't like actively dislike them. She didn't have a reason for killing them other than that they were attacking her, but mm -hmm. she could have not killed them. She could have just like swung them away, but she doesn't want to be the female Titan or she wishes That's, that she could have not right? been the female Titan. That is really interesting because really... that's kind of a catch 22. Mm -hmm. And I wonder why someone who grew up within the walls being attacked by Titans would fight on the Titans side, I guess. Cause like maybe she's not technically fighting like with the Titans, but she's fighting against the humans. So mm -hmm. enemy of my enemy. Yeah, I don't know why living inside the walls, you would keep that a secret and yeah. then use it against the people inside the walls as well. It's weird. Very weird. So I think that's about <laughs> it for questions for this episode. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below if you're excited for episode 24. That's the penultimate episode of season one of Attack on Titan coming this Thursday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you want to see that episode now and the finale, it is on Patreon, so go check it out. All right, I think that's about it. Are we excited for episode 24 of Attack on Titan? Yeah. All right, let's get it. Let's go. <laughs>